Twillo SMS tutorial for beginners. How to send SMS using Twillo. Hey guys, welcome back. Now, if you're looking to get started with marketing or promoting your business or your brand with Twillo, it's a great option for you because Twillo is easy to use and the best part about Twillo is their pricing system. So their pricing system is really bound on how much you're going to be texting and how which country it is in, whether it is inbound or outbound. So your pricing is going to vary accordingly. You will see for long codes, you have a different SMS price for toll-free codes, short codes. Then you also have automatic SMS volume discounts where for inbound messages let's say for the first 150k messages you only have to pay 0 0.0079 cents so in this way you can actually get a discount for your email marketing or sms marketing now to get started with twillo simply click on start for free on the top right now once you click on start for free you're going to sign up and once you've entered a password and your first name and last name then you're just going to click on start your free trial on the bottom. Now, after that, you will get a verification code. And just like that, you're just going to click on verify your email to verify your email address so you can get started with messaging on Twillo. Now, after that, you actually have to enter your phone number. Obviously, you're going to get a code. So I'm going to input that and I'll get back to you guys in a second. So after that, once you have verified your code, you will enter what product you're here to use specifically on Twillo. We're going to be using the SMS and what kind of plan do we have to build with Twillo? So let's say we want to build lead conversion. Now, after that, you are going to add what describes your business. So let's say we're a hobbyist. And after that, you want to add how do you want to build with Twillo? So if you are familiar with code, you can get started with code. However, if you're not familiar with code or if you're not used to using code at all, you can go with the last option. Then you're going to add what your particular goal is today. So let's say it's going to be building something ourselves. And then you're going to click get started with Twillo. Now, once you have clicked on get started with Twillo, you will see a basic onboarding in which they will tell you what kind of basic options you have, how you can get started step by step and the main functions and features of Twillo. So let's get into it. Now, the first thing you have to do is get a Twillo phone number. You will see on the top left, you have the phone number section and you can click on manage. Then you're going to click on active numbers over here and you will see you don't have any Twillo phone numbers. You can click on buy a new Twillo number or port a number to get started with purchasing your Twillo number. So you will see over here that we have a basic country added and these are the multiple different numbers available. We have a monthly fee for these numbers and for most of these numbers it's only $1 and 1.5 Now if you already have a number you can import that as well but if we click on our active numbers over here and go back to purchasing we can go into port a number and once you click on port a number now once you click on port a number you will have to upgrade to get started with porting your number onto twillo now after that you also can click on host numbers over here and once you click on host numbers these will be the numbers that you are using so you can find the particular phone number or phone number sid over here as well now after that you have messaging so if you click on messaging and then click on try it out you can click on send an sms which is what we're focusing on today. So if you click on send an SMS, you will have to get started with a Twillo number. So you can click on get a Twillo number over here. And then you will see on the top right, you will get a free trial number. Now this is only a trial number. This is not a permanent number, but with your trial account, you can send these particular messages and you can just try them out. And once you are ready with them, once you've beta tested them, you can actually go on and purchase your actual phone number that you're going to be using to send your SMS. Now you're going to choose the from section, which is going to be messaging service. Now you're going to enter the particular messaging service you want. Then you're going to type in the body of your text. So like this, we've entered our text. You can enter whatever text you want. This is going to be the text that is going to be sent to the actual person, to the actual phone number. So once you click on this, you're going to click on send test SMS over here like this. Now I've selected phone number on the top section, which is going to be 
from our phone number that we have received in our trial which is this particular phone number i've selected this number now you can click on buy a number to buy your actual number that you're going to be using in the future as well they have a monthly fee but i just like to use the trial number to test out how these messages are being sent so after i've formulated the body of my message i'm going to click on send test sms now you can see the test sms processing and this is the processing by your carrier twilo is still processing now you guys can see that the message will be sent to you now whatever message it was whatever was the top number phone number that you added you will be able to see the particular message now i've received my message sent from your twilo trial account hey there with brings you a season and 70 percent discount watch the source now to get the best deal so i've received this message on my phone so this means that our twilo sms is working now you can use this trial one but one thing to keep in mind is that when you send these trial sms i never recommend them for actual professional use because every time you do this it will automatically enter the text sent from your twilo trial account so this line is going to be added in all of the messages sent from your trial account that is why i like to let you guys know that you should purchase your phone number before you get started with sending messages or sms's on twilo now after this you might want to customize the appearance you can do all that over here and you will see that you have multiple different codes available as well you can copy this code and you can customize this as well if you're someone that is familiar with code however if you're not familiar with code you can do it directly from the left side of your screen and you will just see a code preview now after that you can also do some other things on twilo other than just basic sms you can click on send a whatsapp message and you can send uh, whatsapp messages whatsapp promo messages as well and these things are super helpful because a lot of times people are not using their phones for particular messaging and you might be more in luck if you send messages on whatsapp or on other platforms as well now after that you also have conversations conversations is where you can actually set up conversations with your customers over channels like chat sms whatsapp and you can drive up your engagement and you can click on try it out and this will actually help you manage all of your messaging if you're doing multiple different things such as whatsapp as well as sms then this is going to help you in managing all of those all together now, in this way, you can easily get started with managing your SMS promotion or marketing directly from Twilo. It's easy, simple, and effective. So that was it for today. I hope you guys found this video helpful. Make sure to like this video and subscribe to the YouTube channel and comment down below the best tips and tricks that I have taught you within this video. And make sure to also share this video with your friends and family and to other creators as well so you can help them out as well. And to anyone that might need to know this basic detailed platform and how you navigate through these different social websites so i hope this was helpful enough for you and make sure that you do leave a comment down below if i missed out on anything and if there is anything you would like to add and i will catch you guys in the next video